Hey everybody, James here, Jimmy Screens, Mr. Chiller. I got a ton of shout outs to take care of. I went and did a video on November 16th, but I had forgotten about it with regards to some shout outs, so I figured I would just go ahead and combine all the shout outs that I have. I got a lot of them. I'm going to try to get them all done and pronounced correctly while you're looking at the 55 freshwater aquarium here since I haven't really been showing it lately. So here we go. I've got Ocean Life 69, Mr. Man 316, Edward Eskridge, DWS Darius, Noel Duncan, 111 ADM 111, Warren Donga, CJ Bryson, Stephen Hotz, Art Artiega Eric 97 that's A R T A G A E R I K 97 TLJ 1977 the Bob 3112 1985 Eric Fishman Vic Val Mark Cover 4 or Mark Cover 4 Nick Goodrich Termit Sopa, Tom Hannaby, Alex Griffin, Albert J. Thiel, David Miller, Amiri Ellington, and this last one I honestly cannot pronounce, and I don't know if I can get it on the video there. It's that very last one. I tried to get him to send me a name for it, so I spelled it all out for you guys. Sorry, I just do not know how to pronounce it. So, unfortunately, I can't give an actual name for that one, but it is a shout-out. All right, so anyways, you're looking at the 55. As you can see, the Green Tiger Lotus went absolutely hate. It's clear up here on the top, plus all the uh, frog bit is just insane up here on top. So I've been pulling this stuff out like crazy and just tossing it in the garbage because I've tried mailing it. It don't work to actually mail it, so it ends up melting. I've tried it like two or three times now with Slim Tim. So, you know, it is what it is. But, uh, yeah, I mean, look at this. And then you got the Red Tiger Lotus. It's just absolutely going nuts and getting stuck up over here. This is from the other side. I mean, see, you can see this monster just stretching its way across. And then over here, you've got all these twisted up red and green tiger lotus leaves right here. And, you know, really big ones. There goes a red one there. But look at this stuff. Totally insane. Really pretty. And what I do with these little stragglers here, like this one, I just let them float. <clears throat> when they die off, they die off. So, that's pretty much. I really haven't done much else to the actual tank itself. Uh, just keeping up with water changes. Here's some more baby, baby frog bit that I'm going to end up just tossing. Because this stuff is just nuts. And it just grows everywhere. Here's a leaf from a tiger lotus that's definitely shot. It's going to be coming out of here. I'll show you what it looks like once they actually do go. They look pretty nasty once they go. See if I can get it under there so you can see it. See how it's tearing up? See there? So, yeah, that's all it does. It tears up. It basically just melts. So, that's going to be coming out. And then, pretty much, that's really it as far as this goes. Other than this frog bit driving me absolutely crazy. So, it's like as much as I pull out, it doubles coming back. So, it is what it is, but I'm going to definitely get rid of this stuff. You know, a little at a time, whatever the case may be. So, <laughs> as you can see how much fun I'm having just keeping it over on one side. But, uh, anyways, that's all the shout outs. Uh, next video I do will definitely be when I have to do the saltwater one again. I had done the video regarding the new actinics 
I don't think I really showed them with the actinics being on. I'm going to go ahead and do that and just give a quick update as far as what the coral and everything is looking like at the moment. So I'll see you guys later and thanks for watching. And once again, I appreciate all the new subs. And I apologize for not watching any videos lately. I've been upstate hunting for the past week and we're going to be going up again after Thanksgiving, possibly beforehand. We'll have to see, but either way. All right, guys, so just keeping you up posted as far as what's going on. All right, with that, have a great night. Bye-bye.